Nestled in the French countryside is the headquarters of one of the world's leading companies in hi-fi audio. Focal, who is celebrating 40 years of business this year, still hand makes their speaker cabinets for their extremely high-end speakers in France rather than outsourcing them. Focal has been gaining traction with their headphone products since 2012, but the heritage of world-class audio has made them a legend with audiophiles. Let's take a closer look at Focal and their 40 years of extreme attention to audio. Thanks for watching 9to5Toys! Be sure to like, subscribe, and enable notifications with the bell icon so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Hey everyone, Jordan here with 9to5Toys. I was asked to go to Focal's 40th anniversary event at their headquarters in France. Being relatively new to the Focal brand, I wasn't really sure what to expect, but was blown away by the handcrafted aspect of some of their hi-fi speakers and headphones right there at their headquarters in France. Focal's lineup ranges all the way from the $70 Spark in-ear headphones to the $230,000 Grand Utopia Evo loudspeakers, and everything in between, from car audio to home theater audio to studio reference monitors. Saint Etienne, a manufacturing town two hours outside of Lyon, is the headquarters for Focal. Here at Focal's headquarters is where much of the final assembly happens for their speaker cabinets, as well as their headphone line. And this is where they do a lot of the production as well. So you'll see workers pressing out the cones and building headphones and final testing speakers. And, and it's really impressive to see what all they are doing at their headquarters in St. Etienne. Two hours north in Bourbon Lancy is where they do a lot of the actual fabrication for their high-end speaker systems. Wood comes in in blocks of MDF and HDF from a local French sustainable supplier and through various tools like table saws, 3-axis and 5-axis CNC machines, the blocks are cut down into the appropriate shapes needed for the speaker enclosures. And so of course here is where you can see the start of the monstrous Grand Utopia Hi-Fi speakers. This facility here in Bourbon Lancy used to be a separate company. When Focal bought this manufacturing company just a few years ago, it was being operated in a three-story building right in the heart of the town. Focal ended up working with the actual city of Bourbon Lancy to find a new facility to keep their production there in that town. They figured that the wealth of knowledge that had already been built up with those workers was worth the extra cost of keeping the facility there in Bourbon Lancy rather than moving it closer to Saint Etienne where their final assembly is done. That kind of dedication to craftsmanship speaks volumes in today's manufacturing world. Unfortunately, I wasn't allowed to take any pictures or video in this facility because of new products that hadn't been released at the time, but it was impressive to see the humble beginnings of these incredible speakers being made in a small town in the French countryside by craftsmen and women. This footage from the fabrication facility that we've been showing was sent over by Focal after the event. So back in Saint Etienne, we got to experience a lot of their audio devices in the different showrooms there at their headquarters. Through their different showroom stations, we got to listen to their headphone line, their home audio line, uh, their car audio line, and then all the way up to the Grand Utopia Evo speakers. Focal's doing something pretty awesome with the car audio world. You can either buy kits to install yourself, or they're actually partnering with some French car manufacturers to offer factory installed Focal systems. All right, so let's consider Focal's top of the line speaker, the Grand Utopia Evo. These majestic towers sit at six feet tall and weigh 500 pounds. Just their presence without even playing any kind of music was impressive. But when they did start pumping music through the Grand Utopia, it was the most pure listening experience I've ever witnessed. It sounded and felt like the performers were directly in front of you and you can make out every single instrument in that recording. Focal first developed the Utopia as an in-house reference, kind of their ultimate speaker just for referencing to themselves, a technological challenge. But it became highly regarded in the audio community, and they began to offer them for sale. They really are in a class all of their own, and are just as much a work of art as they are the penultimate in hi-fi audio. So as we saw earlier, the enclosures for these speakers are made in Bourbon Lancy at their fabrication facility, but then the final assembly is done in Saint Etienne. The speakers are assembled, drivers and tweeters are made with a variety of hand and machine presses, which cover a wide line of materials from flax to aluminum to beryllium, and doing a final test to make sure that everything sounds as good as it should. With so many audio products that are often made as cheaply as possible to maximize profit, it's really refreshing and inspiring to see a company like Focal that has such a dedication to high quality audio, and sometimes even takes the more difficult route to make sure that their products are being made in a responsible way. Obviously this is just a short, small intro to Focal, 
If you want to learn more about some of Focal's products, be sure to check out our Sphere Wireless review and our Sib Evo 5.1.2 Dolby Atmos review. Focal's dedication to high quality audio across their entire product line is worth taking a look at. And be sure to check back in again as we have some more exciting Focal reviews coming up. We were sent their entire line of high-end headphones as well as the brand new Arch headphone amp and they are all sounding incredible. Well, thanks for watching this video, and I hope you enjoyed learning a little bit more about Focal. They've been a global pioneer in audio for 40 years, and I can't wait to see what they come out with next. Be sure to check out their website and check out some other reviews on our YouTube channel, and even their special edition 40th anniversary line. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. I'm Jordan with 9to5toys.